first game as a starting nose tackle. What uh, what stood out to you about just the game plan and, and the performance of the defense? Uh, really just focus on myself, um, taking it one day at a time and just getting better every day, every rep, and just keeping it simple. You rotated in quite a bit um, with the odd fronts. How did the communication work between everybody? Uh, just got to know where you at. Uh, coach tell you, like, before, what we're going to do, what we're going to be at, and uh, really just got to listen and play your part, really. With the new scheme, what are you able to get from doing it in an actual game as opposed to doing it in practice for the last three or four weeks? Uh, just being being a team player. Uh, I don't look at... I don't look for like the tackles and everything like that. I just want to fill my gap and make sure Shaq and Oos or whoever's behind me make the tackle and uh, just be a team player. Was there a play that a teammate made that you were particularly proud of that you set up? Uh, man, I, I can't even remember. Um, I think Shaq had a big tackle for loss that I had took on with the double teams and uh, he just came scot free. Uh, that them plays like that make me happy and. Uh, I don't look for nothing else, man. Do you ever sit back and think like how far you've come just since you got here? I mean, being an undrafted guy and working your way up the rotation now starting. Yeah, man, it's it's definitely a blessing. But uh, I try to tell myself to stay humble and just keep my head down and work like I was a undrafted rookie this year. So that's my mindset. In what aspects do you feel like you've improved the most from last year to this year? Uh, just getting more in shape, uh, playing with my hands more even though I got to do that more. But uh, just being a, a football player, a pro football player, and just learning all the tactics for real, yeah. Do you find that younger guys are coming up to you now and asking for? Yeah, it's it's crazy because, uh, it, yeah, like you said, it's a lot of guys that come up and ask me. And, uh, you know, I just try to give them what I heard or what I've learned and uh, just hope that, you know, that plant the seed in their head and get better. Did you grow up a Lions fan? I grew up a Calvin Johnson fan. Uh, <laughs> I watched him a lot. Um, yeah, he was just a Megatron, as you know, and uh, it was exciting to see him every game. Are you going to be like, excited to play them, not just in the preseason, but the regular season? Yeah, for sure. You know, I always had love for my city, so the fact that we play them twice, I get to show my talent twice against them. So, yeah, I'm excited. <laughs> I want to know. I want to know Josh. how you kind of balance being a jolly guy to your teammates versus being, you know, the kind of defensive front dude that's kind of vicious. First right? of all, uh, shy jolly is crazy. Um, <laughs> I do consider myself the hype guy, maybe uh, the guy that brings all the energy or something. But uh, I just I try to be a brother off the field because you just never know what people are going through in life, and uh, I just try to like focus on being that that somebody for him instead of a teammate. And then on the field, it's just a different me. And it's, that's just me, yeah. <laughs> is that on the field presence? Do you have like a name? Is it an alter ego? Oh, uh, yeah, they call me Bully, um, in case y'all ain't know. Get real, Always get real. That, or yeah, that just, it's been me. Like like you said, I'm jolly, happy guy off the field. But when we get on the field, it's a whole different person. I'm the big bully, so yeah. Have you had any cool uh, interactions with Deuce on the practice field? Oh, yeah, me and Deuce go at it all the time. He uh he wants the best from me. He talks so much, man, but it's all love, and he just want to see me compete for real. Yeah, it's my guy. When you first got here, who was that person that you kind of leaned on for advice and tips? And Derek, for sure. Uh, Derek, was he's been with me since my first day, just talking in my ear, getting me right, and that's my guy. I, I look up to Derek. I want to be like Derek. <laughs> he's a beast. Excite you about this this defense as you've gone through training camp and heading to the preseason? I get to show how like talented I am as a run stopper and uh, also as a pass rusher because you get a lot of more one on ones and just showing them that I can be that one that they need and that guy that they trust on in off the field. So. Uh, lots of energy, um, lots of communication. He's very big on communication and just knowing your role, knowing your plays. And, you know, he's a vet, so he expects everything to be crisp, man. You, we just got to give that to him. So I'm excited. Appreciate y'all.